Hey guys, Jen here from Craft Penguin Planner. Welcome to my channel. Today we are going to do a plan with me in my B6TN. Um, when I asked the very first video I did about which planner you wanted to see, um, more people said B6. So this is the one we're going to start with. This TN was custom made. Um, from Hello Happiness Co. When I messaged her and asked her about doing um, a penguin one, because at the time she didn't have any penguin fabric or anything in the shop, and she was very quick about getting back to me, and she found some different fabrics, and this one was the one that really, I really, really liked the most. And then, of course, I told her purple's my favorite color, so she did that and then of course like with the blue I told her that's my second favorite so I just happened to find um, in a D stash some penguin papers and things uh, dashboards so I created some dashboards and whatnot to go in here so um, I just love that oh this is next week um, this is the one planner that I actually plan two weeks out in advance. And that's because this is what I use for um, things related to TPC. Um, I am one of the co-admins for the Planners Collaborative Group along with Caitlin Jackie and Aaron so um, we Caitlin Aaron not Caitlin um, Aaron Jackie and I rotate jobs Caitlin is the chief OCD organizer and you know does all things related to that as well as um, a whole lot of other things behind the scenes and the big old live and all that. Um, but we rotate out jobs. And let me get back to that in just a second. I'm using this mini kit from my shop called Keep Sleeping. And it's really cute, Panda. Inserts by Aurora and Avalon Creations. Um, so, and I pulled out date dots from Cheerful Planner Girl. I figured the orange ones would look nice with this. Um, so, what I do with this planner is I write down mostly when I'm doing Instagram or giveaways for the month. Um, when I'm on graphics, I don't really need it, but if I'm on Instagram like I am this month, I write down the different posts that I've got to do for the day or um, Instagram takeovers that I have to post, things like that. If it's the uh, if I'm on giveaways, I write down the giveaways for that um, day. So that's what I use this planner for is TPC admin work. So it is currently Friday. I planned on filming this yesterday. But I got really, really busy. A lot busier than I expected because I still had several orders to fill from after the sale. Um, so I was working on those. And then once a month, my church does food bank. And I'm one of the people who... Um, helps run it. I actually am the one who checks everybody in 
on the computer gets all that information in there so we had that and lately we've been running it different than we normally would just because of everything going on so we've been doing more of a drive up kind of thing where um one person will run out get ids uh, i don't want to put them all up here right now let me put the washi down first usually i go very linear if you saw when i kind of flipped through here but there are some times that i don't and i'm thinking this week we're not going to go that way um i pulled out these two washi tapes this one's from ps sticker co this one's just another one i have in my stash um so but yeah so we have food bank and we've been using doing a bit more of a drive up kind of way where um we have one person who will run out get ids and then um come in if they're in the system then they don't have to come in at all i just check them in and someone um one of them will bring out hmm, i think we'll go that way uh one of them will bring out the bag and put it in their car and send them on their way um but usually we'd have them come in but you know how things are right now so I had that and then I was just really really tired having okay that one's not gonna tear too well S let's get my slice tool by the way Tombow is also linked in my Amazon store along with the slice tool um, and the tweezers are from perfect Prince Co I will have all that links down below um, so I was just, I was really, really tired after everything yesterday. When you've been working from the time you get up till the time you go to bed and only stopping for things like food and restroom breaks and things like that um, for a couple weeks trying to process orders because let's face it, that's what I do um, during the sale. I get up and I work and then I work all day long so when you when you do that as long as I was this time then um, I know this one usually tears well there we go um, it kind of it kind of catches up to you so yeah, that's why I'm filming today instead of yesterday. And I wanted to do this more during the day and not so much at night to see if maybe um, I can get the lighting better. So, hopefully that is better. All right, so now I need to put everything for the days let's see so I asked in my Facebook group if anybody had some questions or anything that they wanted me to answer um, and we won't have time to go through all of them today which is fine because um, I'll be doing more videos obviously and so, ooh, I hope, there we go. I just couldn't get up under it. Taryn asked, do, I, do you read? If so, who are your favorite authors? Honestly, I don't read a whole lot. Um, never really have. And I don't know if... It's just because when I was a teacher, I just didn't have a lot of time. Um, 
or what I know when I was younger I used to do a lot of reading but I did struggle with reading growing up um, I was actually in a special reading class in second grade I think because I was so far behind um, so I've never been a huge huge reader I so I really don't have any favorite authors or anything that I can tell you offhand just because like I said I don't I don't read a whole lot um, I have listened to a couple of audiobooks somewhat more recently it's been a few months ago now but um, I'm gonna put this one up here um, kind of switch it up a little bit while I've been working on orders some um, let's see I want to do a full box next yeah I think so so yeah I I'm trying to remember what did I listen to um overcomer I don't know if any of you've seen that movie but um the book is really awesome I think I've listen to Breakthrough as well. Um, or at least I know I was in the middle of it. I might have to go back and look and see if I ever finished that. Okay, so there's some other really good questions on here. I'm not sure I'm going to have enough time all day to, to answer all of them. Um, let's see. Kelly asked Kelly and her silly questions. She's Hmm. Let's see. I guess we will still. We'll just go across. She said, "Is it sock sock shoe shoe or sock shoe sock shoe?" Well, Kelly. Considering I actually wear socks all the time, even to bed, um, it's sock sock shoe shoe. Because by the time I go to put my shoes on, if I'm leaving the house for anything, then um. I will have already had socks on my feet. So, yeah. Love your silly questions. Um, let's see. Sarah, I know I saw, there we go. Sarah asked, what's your favorite movie? I don't, I can't really say I have a favorite movie per se, but if I have to pick something, um, you know it's going to happen. You know what I'm going to say. Let's go with Mr. Popper's Penguins. Or Happy Feet. What's the common theme? You got it. Penguins. I have a bit of a penguin obsession. I think it's the date cover that's crooked here. Um, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to fix it. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Come on, girl. Come on, come on, come on. Nope. It's not going to fix too easily. That's all right. We got it mostly. Um, yeah, I just have a... I have a thing for penguins. And I honestly don't even know what started it. But I do. I just have a thing for penguins. Um, I think we'll do the box next to cover up where those lines are. Because I don't like seeing the white out. I don't like seeing the lines through either, which is why I'm using the um, Tombow. And um, so what what these are for? I'm on Instagram this month, so these will be. I'll use the checklist for like my posts that I actually, you know, the actual posts that I do, whether it be for you know posting when they're having the giveaways or the product posts or even the story posts but the boxes here will be this week we'll definitely have instagram takeovers because it's going to be the week before the sale so i'll write down what the takeovers are here so that way i know who's i have to post um some of the other ones are really good I think this is a really good video to talk about how did you discover TPC Patricia asked and then Stephanie also asked how did you how I got started in TPC so 
this one's actually kind of to give you a little bit of a backstory. I've been with TPC since the very, very beginning. Like, very beginning. Um, when my shop was, well, I, I could say when my shop was smaller, but at the very beginning, I, when I very first started my shop, I came across someone, well, more or less they came across me on Instagram. And it was kind of by accident because someone had changed their Instagram handle to Crafty Penguin Planner the week or like one, one week. They, they changed it, but it was after I already had my Instagram handle because I had just started my shop and um, so it was literally one letter separating their handle from mine and so somebody commented on it and said Jennifer is this you now we're just getting creepy because I'm a Jennifer so It was referencing somebody else. Well, come to find out, this other Jennifer is also obsessed with penguins. Lives about 30 to 40 minutes from me. Is a teacher, which I used to be. And loves to plan. How creepy is that? So... <laughs> Um, yeah, I, was then invited, I think we're going to put the checklist up here, um, then come to find out she had, uh, local meetups and for planner meetups. So I was actually invited to join a local planner group and come to some of the meetups. Well, I did. And then I came across Jackie from Keep It Simple Stickers through, whoops. I said I was gonna put my checklist here and then I put the full box down. I uh, see, I was too busy talking. Let's see if I can get it up. Um. Because Jackie had sent some samplers to uh, for that meetup to give out for some extra goodies. Oh, okay. Well, we're just going to write over that. So, um, so I came across Jackie through there with her sampler. And it had some of her hand-drawn little bits and... I thought they were adorable, so I checked out her shop. Well, in checking out her shop and following her on Instagram, I found a group sale that she had been a part of, and so I followed that sale, and, you know, eventually I became a part of it, once I, I started to grow as a shop more and I moved away from printables and um, into more physical stickers, I applied and was a part of that sale. At the time, Caitlin was also an admin or was an admin. Jackie wasn't an admin of that one, but she regularly participated in the sale so Caitlin was an admin of that group so I got to really know Caitlin and Jackie and oh it's empty as Caitlin would say thank you for your service and I already have another one ready to go um because I kind of had a feeling that was gonna happen so 
I, I think I'm going to put this down and then we may have to cover up part of it with one of these boxes. Um, so I got to know Caitlin and Jackie and I'm trying to remember if Aaron was part of that group or not at the time. I don't remember. I think she may have been, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. Um, but I got to know them a little through that group. So Caitlin remembers me from my shop from when it was a wee little baby. Um, so I think we're going to cut this one down to two. Um, so when Caitlin and Jackie decided to go start TPC, of course, I knew about it. I had heard about it. At that point, Jackie and I had already become good friends and, you know, I had known Caitlin and so I knew about TPC right when it came about. So, of course, I've got to follow my friends over, right? So, I followed them right over to TPC, joined. I was, like, there the, the second it was open. And so, yeah, I've been with TPC since day one. Literally, day one. So, <clears throat> it's just because I had known Caitlin and Jackie through another sale that I'd been a part of that, um, oh, yeah, I'm gonna have to cut this one down. Um, so just because I had known them from before, I was, um, aware of TPC beginning and I was able to get my start in TPC right away. So, there's the backstory on that, which is how I got to know Caitlin and Jackie um, and really be introduced to a wide <clears throat> range within the planner community um, and how I discovered TPC. So I think... Because there are going to be takeovers that day, I may go ahead and still put, I may put this one down here, cover up part of this washi, and that's okay. And I think we're just going to put this one here, let it blend in a little bit, but this will be for the takeovers that day. There's only going to be one giveaway that day, I believe, so... Um, Actually, I think there's only one giveaway this day. I could probably cut that even shorter and move that up, but I think we'll just leave it. Um, so I'll write in the takeovers for that day there. Let's see. Oh, and let's put, I don't know if I can fit it. You know what? Let's just do it anyway. Um, so yeah, um, if you guys have any questions or anything you want me to answer. Oh, let me make sure you're in frame. Um, if there's anything you're curious about, then feel free to drop a comment below and I will try to get to it in one of my next videos. Um, there's still a few more that I haven't answered from this, from my group. Um, that's Craft Penguin Planner Waddle. But I will work on getting to those in one of my next videos. So I, was, I pulled out these clips because I wasn't sure which one I'm going to put with it. I just, I don't know that one or that one. I'm thinking it might be this one. But let me know if you think you... Um, have a preference. These are from Clippy Chick Creations. Um, and I do want to give her a little shout out because somehow in the past month or so, I managed to misplace two of my bows. And honestly, I don't know how it happened because one of them is one I use 
all the time. Like, all the time. And it just out of nowhere went missing. So, I was talking to Karen and she was actually able to um, help me replace it. Um, one of them was this one. This is the one I use all the time. Like, literally all the time. This pretty blue goes with so many. See, that would even probably work well with this. Um, and this one was still in her shop, but the other one wasn't in her shop. And I feel like it was a freebie clip from one of the months she was in the sale. And, um, <clears throat> so I even had a picture with one of my planners, or I think it was this one actually, um, where I used the clip. And I showed her, and she just happened to have found more of that ribbon. And this is that clip right here. So she was able to, thankfully, um, with my order, she was able to help me get another one of these. So thank you, Karen, so much. I really appreciate it. I do hope the others turn up soon. Um, I've, like, searched high and low in the old office because I've been looking for them, but... At least now I have replacements for them because I really like these clips and I use them. So, thank you for that. So, yeah. i um, going to decide which one we're going to pair with this. If you have your thoughts, let me know. If you have things you want me to talk about here on the channel, let me know. Um, and... We will see which one I'm going to do next. I'm not sure if it's going to be the Penny Weeks or the EC next. Um, I'll probably be back on next week with one of those. So, um, yeah. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. All the shops will be linked down below, including Perfect Prints Co. And my Amazon store for some of these supplies. Alright guys. Have a great day, and we will see you in my next video. Hope you'll give this a big thumbs up, and subscribe down below. Bye!